Hello, Kenny Evans here. Got another car video. The topic of this video, or the title of this video, is Don't Ever Be Intimidated by Woman's Success. Before I get into the video, I do want to let you guys know, as I always do, I know we got some new people here. Welcome. I know we got some people who've been here for a while. Welcome. Um, you know, for both, those who have not already, uh, subscribe, hit the notification button so you'll be notified whenever I upload some new videos. And of course, if you just want to support me or if you like my videos, hit the thumbs up and like the videos. I definitely appreciate it. Uh, but yes, you know, this channel, again, I obviously I created this channel. It is not just about dating relationships. You know, it's all about helping you guys become men and women, become the best you can be in all aspects of your life. Not just dating relationships, but also health, wealth, and mindsets. I want you to be a complete person, or be, I want you guys to be complete people in the best versions of yourself in all aspects of your life. You know, so uh, that's it. This is what this channel is about, you know, and um, yeah, just got to let y'all know. Uh, but yes, let us get back into the topic at hand. Don't ever be intimidated by woman's success. So a lot of guys, you know, feel if a woman's successful, oh, she's going to be miserable and she's going to be, you know, potentially a bitch. It's going to be hard to get along with, hard to date. And to a certain extent, she will be. Because she had to work her way up. She was in her masculine to get to where she was, she is. You know, and to be that successful, you have to be a leader. You know? Um, but when it comes to us as strong men, we are the leaders. And, you know, any woman we, we deal with, they follow us. They follow our lead. You know, so I'm going to give you all some tips here tips and tricks on how you can uh, first not be intimidated by success, a woman's success, but also how to make a successful woman follow you and follow your game plan. First and foremost, first tip you always got to realize, even successful women want, and I don't even, not even say want, but need a strong man because for them to like I said to for them to get to where they were and where they are now and where they want to go they have to be a leader they have to be more in their masculine and women are not designed to be in their masculine for long periods of time but a lot of these successful women have been you know so they stress a lot like a man who is working their way up the corporate ladder, they stress a lot. And women are just, again, they're not used to doing dealing with that for long periods of time. So, you you know, they'll be a little bit more emotionless. They'll be a little bit more um, short-fused, angry. You know what I mean? So a strong man, naturally, as a leader, will take some pressure off of them. A strong man will take some pressure off of them and allow them to be able to relax and really just so they could follow the lead of that strong man, make their lives easier. You know what I mean? That's just what it is. A strong man will allow a successful woman to relax and um, just be, be a little bit more at peace. That is one thing. The first tip you got to realize, you know, even a successful woman want a strong man. Second tip. <sighs> strong, successful women, they think they're what a strong man wants. And they are sadly mistaken. Because again, because they are so in their masculine, they're all about success and drive and accomplishing goals. They think since they are where they are, other men strong men specifically will be attracted to them and that is where they're wrong because again they're thinking like a man 
you know, or the thinking like a woman, but, you know, uh, with the, a masculine twist, you know what I mean? Because if, instead of feeling like, hey, a, a man will want to be with a woman who is the opposite, they think a man would want to be with a woman who is like them, <laughs> You know what I mean? In the masculine and everything. You know, and they 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 got that twisted because they're so used to um accomplishing goals and getting what they want, they think all they gotta do is show up. You know what I mean? And have a decent personality, you know, which most of them don't. Because again, they're more in their masculine. You know what I mean? So they think they could just show up and they'll be able to get whatever man a strong man they want. You know, and, and, and they're wrong. You know what I mean? They are definitely wrong. And that's the second thing you got to keep in mind. Their their view of men is in dating is, is warped. You know, so, uh, yeah. That's that second tip. Third tip. Her success is for her, not for you. So it doesn't matter how much money that she has. You know, if she's not willing to spend it on you, um, then it doesn't matter. You know what I mean? And again, as a strong man, you don't want a woman who is going to try to mom, uh, kind of be like a, a sugar mama towards you, you know, and kind of take care of you outside of what you want. You know what I mean? It's cool if she wants to buy you things, take you on trips, do certain things for that, but you're still the leader. She wants to surprise you with stuff that's cool. But in the end, you, you're doing your own thing. You're leading the way. And that is also financially. Or even if you're not there financially yet, you're working your way up. Because it's all about self-respect. You don't want a, you know, a woman who's paying all your bills. And because then it's like she's your mama. <laughs> you know what I mean? And you don't want a woman who, who treats you like a child. You know what I mean? So even if you're not there yet financially and she's the breadwinner, Work your way up. If she wants to do, you know, take you on trips and buy you stuff, cool. But as long as you are still the lead, you're still the head of the 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 the, the, the relationship or the couple. You know what I mean? So, um, or the interaction, you have to be the leader. If she wants to support you, cool. But you still got to be the leader, and you constantly got to be working your way up and getting better. So. Third tip there. Fourth tip. Always realize, um, you know, when it comes to being a, a strong man here, you, hold on, apologize here. Yes, you always have to lead women. You always have to lead women. As a strong man, you lead women. It doesn't matter whether she's successful, whether she's uh, not successful. You lead. You know, you come into a space and there's a woman who you want. You lead her and that space becomes yours. You have to lead that woman. You know, and of course, if she is not willing to follow your lead, you let her go. Cut her off. You know, fourth tip there. As a strong man, you always have to lead women. You know, especially women who are, um, who show interest. Because if they're not willing to follow your lead, they really are not that down for you. And you got to let them go. Of course, you got to have that abundance mindset. Realize there's other women out there who will follow your lead. So, default. As a strong man, you lead women, period. You know. So yes, fourth tip, fifth tip, I said fourth, <laughs> fifth tip, fifth and final tip here on ways not to be intimidated by a woman's success. You always have to realize if she's willing to be feminine, with you, you win. That's the key. That's how you get the leader. That's how you get her to follow your lead. That's how you get her to to to, to appreciate you more. You gotta get her out of her masculine. 
and that starts from the jump. You have to say, hey, when she's trying to, the man try to leave, say, hey, sit back, relax. I got this. I understand you're used to being the boss, but I'm the boss now. You'll be all right. Just, yes, you got to trust me. Sit back, relax. Everything will be all right. I promise you. You just got to calm her down. Let her know you are the man. You are a strong man at that. And it, it, it your words are powerful, but your actions are more powerful. You got to show it. Set maybe, you know, um, you meet her at a bar, lead her to the bar, you want to get a drink or lead her outside, you know, tell her to call you, just give her direction. Let her know that she is safe to follow your lead. You know what I mean? Um, you, you set a date, you got to set the date, you know, um, if you want to go out with her, you, you know, you want to have sex, you got to lead the interaction towards sex. Whatever you're doing with her, you got to lead because that way she will get more used to you leading. And then naturally, as you become more in your masculine and you lead, she'll be more submissive. You know what I mean? You cannot let her control the dynamic and lead the interaction because then she'll stay in her masculine. You have to lead the interaction as a strong man. You know, so that is crucial. Leading interaction. And obviously, she has to be in her feminine. If she's willing to be in her feminine, you win. Because then she's willing to follow your lead. You know, granted, you're a strong man and you lead her in a, in a positive direction. Both of you guys in a positive direction. You know, so that is all I got for y'all today. You know, reasons, tips. You should not be intimidated by woman's success. Of course, let me know what I forgot. Let me know if you, you agree with all my uh, my tips. Let me know if you disagree. Um, of course, like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification button. And even if you dislike the video, leave me a comment. Let me know what you disliked about the video. Respectfully, of course. And, um, you know, uh, I'll get back to you. You know what I mean? Um, yeah. I, also, of course, let me know what other topics you want me to talk about. I know, again, I talked about a lot of dating relationships here but we have health wealth and mindset as well the dating relationships let me know what other topics you want me to talk about because again i want this channel to help you guys both men and women to be the best you can be in all aspects of your life so you can be the best versions of yourself you know and of course if you find value in the video you know i appreciate your donations any little bit counts it's all about helping this channel grow helping me be better you know, and in inevitably helping you guys be better. You know, so I appreciate any little donations you can you 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 send if and only if you find value in the video. That's all. But uh yeah. Until next week, y'all stay safe, be aware, you know, and always remember the strongest man is the happiest man.